Hello, Desi Stars. Cuddle up and get ready for a not-so-creepy bedtime story. If this is your first bedtime story with Desi, please subscribe and become part of our Desi Stars family because my library is full of books I'd love to read to you. Today we're going to read Creepy Carrots. Words by Aaron Reynolds, pictures by Peter Brown. Creepy Carrots. Jasper Rabbit had a passion for carrots, and the carrots that grew in Cracker Hopper Field were the best, fat, crisp, and free for the taking. He pulled some for a morning snack on the way to school. He yanked out a few on his way to Little League practice. He ripped them from the ground on his way home at night. Jasper couldn't get enough carrots until they started following him. What? He first noticed something strange after the big game against the East Valley Hares. Jasper was about to help himself to a victory snack when he heard it. The soft, sinister tunk, tunk, tunk of carrots creeping. Look at their yellow eyes. He turned, but there was nothing there. Just my imagination, he thought, but he hopped a little faster. That night, as he was brushing his teeth, there they were. Jasper whipped around, but nothing. He laughed at himself, picked his toothbrush off the floor, and went to bed, quickly. Those orange things were just his bath time things. The next morning, he approached Krakenhopper Field slowly. Look at him peeking around over each corner. He reached for two wild carrots. Nothing happened. He bit into one. Nothing happened. Phew, creepy carrots. It was ridiculous. But when he arrived home that evening, Mom! Mom! Jasper screamed. Creepy carrots in the shed! His mom opened the door slowly. There weren't any carrots. Not even the regular kind. Look, those orange things were just gardening tools and some paint. There are no such things as creepy carrots, Mom said, shaking her head. Later that night, as Jasper lay in bed, he heard it. Breathing. Terrible, carroty breathing. And there on his wall. Creepy carrots, he shouted. Dad, Dad! His dad thumped into his bedroom and threw on the light. Those creepy carrots were just a bucket with a stuffed animal inside. Silly rabbit. They searched under the bed. No creepy carrots. They looked through the closet. No creepy carrots. They opened the dresser drawers. No creepy carrots. Just a bad dream, son. His dad said, shaking his head. Now go to sleep. That wasn't going to happen. Look at his eyes wide open. He's terrified. By the end of the week, Jasper was seeing creepy carrots creeping everywhere. He thought the curtains were carrots. He thought the trash off the curb were carrots. He thought the flowers at the cemetery were carrots. Yikes. Jasper knew his parents were wrong. Creepy carrots were real, and they were coming for him. He has an idea. But they couldn't get him if they couldn't get out. Jasper hatched a plan. First thing on Saturday, he grabbed supplies and headed to Krakenhopper Fields. 
Whoa, that's a lot of supplies he's carrying. Look at him getting to work, lining up that field. Now he's sewing some wood. Now he's digging up some sort of path around the carrots. Oh boy, he's filling that path up with water. And now he's hammering away. As the sun finally set across Krakenhopper Field, Jasper Rabbit smiled. On his way home, there was no tunk, tunk, tunk. There were no carrot-shaped shadows. His plan had worked. No creepy carrots would ever get out of that carrot patch again. Look, he built a huge, tall fence around the carrots. And that area he filled with water Somehow he also got alligators in there. Such a determined rabbit. And as the sun finally set, the carrots of Kraken Hopper Field, look at them peeking out through the fence, cheered. Their creepy plan had worked. They were sure of it. Jasper Rabbit would never get into that carrot patch ever again. Look how happy they are, jumping around, smiling. They just didn't want to be eaten. <laughs> Silly carrots. The end. If you enjoyed this book, you too can have your own copy. Just use the link in my description box below to know where you can buy it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with a good friend. I just can't wait to read to you again. Until next time, Desi Stars.